Welcome to Spice and Pens. Subscribe to our channel for our recipes weekly. Hi and welcome to Spice and Pens. Today we'll be cooking stir fry stingray with salted vegetables. So let's start cooking. First, heat up a pan. I'm using the shogun pan by La Gourmet. Add in oil. We need to fry the bean paste as well as the ginger, garlic and chili. Swirl the oil around, make sure it's well coated in the pan. Add in one thumb sized ginger julienne. Three cloves of garlic chopped. Two red chili julienne and de-seeded. If you like it more spicy, you can add in chili party or bird's eye chili. Fry this until fragrant. This is a very popular dish or it's easy to cook household dish. When I was young, my dad used to bring me to this porridge store and one of the specialties is this. I really love this a lot. Once you can smell the fragrance coming up from all this, you add in the bean paste. One tablespoon of spicy soya bean paste. There's two types. One is using soya bean like this and the other type is broad bean paste. So if you're allergic to broad bean, always use the soya bean paste. The spicy one for this. That's one tablespoon. Add in half a tablespoon of black soya bean paste. See how it's really fantastic right now. I really love this kind of smell. Making me hungry just by the beautiful mixture of fragrance of this beautiful sauce over here. Now we'll add in one and a half cup of water. We'll cover it up and let it come to a boil. Once it is boiling, we'll add in the stingray. 400 grams of stingray. Now in case you can't get stingray in where you live, you can actually use shark meat or even whole fish. But if you're using whole fish, try not to stir too much. Just put them in and let them boil in this beautiful gravy. I'll be adding in also 150 grams of salted vegetables. I've rinsed julienne them like this, into sizes like this, and also soak them in water for 20 to 25 minutes. And one whole tomato, cut into six pieces like this. And we put the lid back on and let it braise for 15 minutes. See you in a while. Okay, 15 minutes is up. Let's have a look. Smells heavenly. We need to add in a little bit of sugar to balance up the taste. Half a teaspoon of sugar. So time to serve this beautiful dish. So now we're done cooking. So now we're done cooking. So now we're done cooking. Let me give it a taste and let you know how it tastes like. Mmm. Very nice. You have the spicy bean paste, the fragrance and aromatics of the ginger, the chili. Beautiful to go with rice. So ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoy our video. Do click like on our video and do subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.